Hi, I'm Jignesh Shah and I work in Samtex high-speed connector products. Today I wanted to show you a demonstration of our high-speed Tunax cables and our 56 gig PAM4 and 112 gig PAM4 high-speed connectors. Here we have our signal integrity demonstration using the Credo Pelican chip running at 112 gig PAM4 with a bit error rate of 3e to the power minus 7. Here is another demonstration of our flyover QSF DD to our accelerate cable running at 56 gig PAM4 using a Xilinx chip, GTM chip, and with a bit error rate of 5e to the power minus 15. Customers agree that the signal integrity performance of cable products is really very good. But the questions they have is, how are they going to manage all these cables and manage the thermals and have low cost in for a high density network switch? What we have here is a modular architecture in which we've taken the ASIC chip and moved it further behind, away from the front panel QSFP DD. What this allows is for better cable management and also much better thermals as we move the high power ASIC chip further away from the temperature sensitive front panel QSFP DD. And it also addresses the issue of cost. Because the ASIC module is much smaller in size than the standard high speed PCB in a conventional design, the resulting cost of this modular design is in par or cheaper than a conventional design. And here we have the same architecture, but the thermal demonstration of that architecture. We have 32 QSFP DDs that can be powered all the way from 7 watts to 14 watts. And the ASIC chip that can be powered all the way to 500 watts. And the airflow can be modulated all the way to 110 CFM. What we've shown here today is a good starting point for a modular architecture. Please contact our HDR group and we can work with you to find a specific solution for your application. Thank you.